guys welcome to my channel or welcome back if you are new welcome so i forgot to film this intro so here it is just a couple days later if you like this makeup look or you want to see how i got it go ahead and check out the left right makeup challenge on my channel i got the infamous kylie skin foaming face wash on my boxy chart let's go ahead and talk about my skin dye i have combination skin i have normal skin around my face and then just in my t-zone i get really really oily um, every once in a while, I'll get oily down on my chin, but that's like next to never. It has to be like a really bad day. My skin is really, really easy to take care of. All I have to do is wash it, and in two days, it's cleared up. That's kind of how my skin goes. So I wanted to put this to the test and see if it actually did anything. Could be because I saw some people who said it doesn't even work. It's just kind of there. It has a name on it. That's why people are buying it. So I wanted to test it. <laughs> so I wash my face every single day for two weeks to test this. I will go ahead and start here from day one. I did only wash it at night. Every night I followed it up with the same exact moisturizer that I always use. I didn't change my skincare routine. The only thing I changed was this Kylie Skin Face Wash. I also paired this up with my Clarisonic. Just so there was no tampering. I'm really, really good about cleaning my brush heads, but just to be sure, I did put a new brush head on this so that only the Kylie product is on here. So with that being said, let's jump into the video and see how it went these past two weeks. Hey guys, so last night was the last night that I will be using the Kylie Skin product. I made the choice because my skin has been looking so dull and dry and flaky and crispy and I never really get blackheads but I've had nothing but blackheads since I've started using this product. So I'm not going to finish the two weeks out. I will show you what my skin looks like right now. However, it does look a bit better because all day I've just been drenching it in moisturizer more than I ever would. I have extremely oily skin and my skin looked like I had dry skin since I started this product. At first it wasn't terrible but now it's like I need to stop because it's terrible for my skin and I can feel and see it. So again, the, I didn't change anything in my routine except for using this face wash instead of my normal one and I've had nothing but blackheads. I've had the deep under the skin pimples which I never really get I maybe get once or twice every couple months I've had multiple of them I have some now I've just been breaking out and having a hard time over here so I'm gonna go ahead and show you what my skin looks like but I cannot recommend this product it looks a lot better now than it did because I drenched it in moisturizers and everything so here so here's my skin so I have some coming in here, up here, I have some coming in here, I got a real deep one under the skin here, 
here I have one coming in and I never really break out here as well as my chin is really bad and above my lip and these are the main places I don't ever really break out is my nose my lip and my chin I have some over here which is pretty normal if I'm not taking care of my skin and then up here I do have a bunch and I have one that's like under my skin that's really really painful so that with all the blackheads I will no longer be using this product as you guys can see day four was definitely the worst for me I went ahead and used these blemish patches that I got from the dollar store these work amazing and I just put that on because I could not deal with it and go to work with that anymore I hope that you guys like this video if you did go ahead and like and subscribe down below bye